just what I was looking for. So I'm going to see if I can do like a mini haul, I guess. If there's anything to buy. Going to Sephora and Rome. Let's see what they have. That's good from Sephora. I like the foundation, it's supposed to be good, isn't it? This. And I don't have much of it. I don't know. Oh, that's good. I just looked at the price, it's $17.99. That's so cheap. I might have to get that dry. This is the shade, not bad. It's quite big. Oh, there's a glow one. I like the glow one more. This could be nice. I'm so tempted by this. And it's so pretty. Well, it's so soft. It's very gold. It's kind of pretty though. Let's see the champagne one. So my hands are dry. That's a good highlight. Is this a new one? Is that just supposed to be a blush? Oh, that might be worth trying. I'm kind of gutted about this. This looks actually sick. Like the, this colour here looks amazing. Look at that. Oh, I wish they had it. That's so pretty. If I see another sport, I will get it. Oh, they've got 57 in the glare. Or 55. Five 
and that's okay. I asked the lady, she said this is the best seller at the moment. And I want to try this foundation. So I can't really tell. This one doesn't have a sample. And I tried this one. It's a bit rich, but it wasn't too bad. But it's quite like a full coverage. Whereas this one seems like it's going to be more glowy. But it seems a bit light for me right now. I'm tempted to get big because I think they're like 12 99 If that's true, let me double check. If that's true, then I'll just get both. I like the highlighters. They're really cute. I'm tempted to get the um, Always an Optimist by Rare Beauty. I think it's going to be nice. Um, but yeah, I think that's probably it for now. I'm going to get the lighter one. Sorry, rich one. Still love you. Okay, we found a tester, so we're going to get the lighter one, the glowy one. This is my Sephora haul. And I'll be doing a video for Friday. So guys, I'm back. I'm going to show you my Sephora haul. Should I do it here or should I do it on the bed? Is that more like YouTuber-y? I think the bed's a vibe. So this is, I went to Sephora in Rome. This is what I got. All right, actually, I also got some other stuff from other places. But So I got a sheet mask, watermelon. The reason I picked watermelon was because it said it was quenching and plumping. And I felt like that was exactly what I needed, a quench and a plump. I also got two random things from Tiger, which I won't show you. I also got the, oh, she gave me the Gizu hair perfume, which is actually really cool because I feel like I'd love some hair perfume right now. Because um, my hair's due a blow dry. Um, so I'm going to be trying this out. I also picked this up. They, the lady in Sephora said... That this was like the best selling mascara of the moment. It's new and she said it's done really well. She showed me the campaign photo and she was like, there's no airbrushing, uh, no retouching or anything. So it looks pretty good. So I'm going to give that a go. And I also, I really wanted the ABH palette, but they didn't have it. So I got the Natasha Denona mini Bieber palette because I've always wanted to try the Bieber palette and this was there and I thought, why not? Um, so I'm going to be trying that. And because I desperately needed dry shampoo, I got the Moroccan oil dry shampoo, which I've never tried. And sadly just realized I'm not gonna bring back, even though it was probably super expensive. Um, so that's upsetting. But yeah, let's see if it's any good. And I got the nose highlight. Oh, and I got the nose highlight. Well, the highlighter from Sephora, the slightly lighter one, because that looks quite good as a nose highlighter and it seemed to lift my face a little bit more than the other one did. And considering it's a highlighter, I thought I would get something that highlighted. Um, and also, last but not least, I got the foundation. I'm hoping this is the right shade. I got this in the shade 55N. Obviously, I'm in Italy. Um, the options weren't as diverse as I would have hoped they'd have been, as I'm, I'm sure they are in the US, but they did have some options, so I guess, you know, it's not, it's not ideal. But they had this, they didn't have, oh, we tried the tester on my hand and it seemed okay, even though it's a bit light, um, it seemed okay, and I feel like it's probably going to be my winter shade. Uh, there was a richer one in the non-glowy one, but it did feel a bit high coverage, and he did say, like, he felt like this would be better on my, my skin. It's just a bit more glowy and fresh. So I took his word because I genuinely felt like that anyway. Um, so this is my mini little Sephora haul. I'm going to be doing a video on it on, for Friday, hopefully. As you guys probably can tell, I'm in Italy at the moment, so... 
my hourglass still didn't come. It actually arrived, but then they said they missed me. Um, they said they delivered it, and then they said they missed me. Um, so I'm just having to freestyle. Uh, and I would do it tonight, but I'm absolutely shattered. So I'm just going to do the video on Friday. I hope you guys bear with me. Um, and yeah, hopefully it'll be good. <laughs> 